Let us look at one more question on trig equation where I would like to do in a graphical way and then I will we'll check the answer on the calculator. So the question is solve for x between 0 to 360 degrees and the question is the equation is sine 4x is equal to 0 0.31. So I want to graph sine 4x okay, and then I will explain how to solve it. So here if you have seen my previous videos first decide the amplitude. The amplitude is 1 here. Yeah? So, and your baseline is 0. So, this is your baseline. Uh, this is your maximum and this is your minimum. So, your maximum is plus 1. I would like you to uh, ref, uh, look at my other videos where I have gone in detail how to decide this. So, amplitude is 1. So, maximum is uh, baseline plus amplitude. This is your zero, which is your baseline. Okay, and uh, this four tells me that within 360 degrees, the sine curve will uh, repeat itself four times. So here, the period of this uh, sine curve is 90 degrees. Or in <coughs> excuse me, if this the sine curve repeats itself uh, four times within 360 degree, then one period is 90 degree, logically. So let me draw one cycle. So this is one cycle has got four steps. So this is four steps. So we are saying this has got one cycle of 90 degree. So half of 90 is 45 and half of 45 is 22.5. So this is called a step of 22.5. So 22.5, 45, this is 67.5. Okay, 67.5. So let me write it properly. 67.5. Changing color. So sine curve starts at baseline, 0, 0, reaches maximum at 1. Again, hits baseline, minimum. So this is one cycle. So this is your sine curve. We can do with this in a unit circle, but I believe that this will explain things more. Now the question is, when is this 0 0.31? So 0 0.31, so this is a 0.5. Okay, so 0 0.31, uh, let me use a dotted. So 0 0.31 some, okay, comes somewhere here, yeah, roughly. 0 0.31 is here. So the question is, what is this? Of course, this is baseline. I'm, I'm not drawing the x-axis. So, uh, x-axis is somewhere down. Okay, so this is the reference angle. So this is one value of 0 0.31. The other value will be symmetrical to... Okay, so let me explain now. So here, this is 0 0.31. This point is, I'm saying roughly this is 0 0.31. This is 0 0.5, so 0 0.3. One would come here somewhere. So this is what my question is. What are these two angles? Or what are these two measures? Or these are the x on the x-axis. This is a question mark. Okay. So let me take a brighter color. So we do the same way. 4x. Okay. Or your reference angle 4x is sine inverse of 0 0.31. So where's my calculator? This is my calculator run, I'll set in degrees first, degrees, and then I go shift sign of 0 0.31, close the bracket, I should have put a bracket here, oh. a bracket, and equal, so it is 18 degrees, okay, rounding it, so this is 4x is 18 degrees, so if you divide uh, both sides by 4, so your x is uh, 18 divided by 4 is 9, half of 18 is 9, so this is 4.5. So your reference angle is 4.5. So that is true because it's positive. So the first value of x is 4.5. And as this is symmetrical, this value 
I hope you understand can be is 45 minus 4 point this gap this is 4.5 degrees so this would also be if you can understand symmetry if this is 4.5 degrees this point would be 4.5 degrees away from 45 so the other value of x would be 45 minus 4.5 okay so let me do it 45 minus I can do this without the calculator sorry 45 minus 4.5 which is 40.5 so one within 90 degrees you have 40.4.5 and 40.5 but the question is you want, you want all the axes between 0 to 360 so now to get the other axis you have to simply add 90 to this because this will be repeated every 90 degree because the period is 90 degree so the next answer would be plus 90 would be 94.5 plus 90 is 130.5 okay hopefully I'm right so next let me extend this if you add 90 this is 184.5 and plus 90 is 220.5 am I right 90 yep yeah. and again so you got one two three four five six you got two more because this has got this is 4x so if it was x you have two answers so you have eight answers here plus 90 is 274.5 and this would be plus 90 which is 310.5 so let's check this on a calculator so go to your graph and type in sine of 4x like this and you need to check your we want a trig scale from between 0 to 360 step of 22.5 so that you can see the four cycles okay and the scale y-axis is fine so can you see four so this is one cycle this is the second cycle this is the third cycle and the fourth cycle so the question is where is this becoming 0 0.31 so g solve and x calc so type in 0 0.31 and the first answer is 4.5 the next answer is 40.48 which is 40.5 that's fine the next is 94.5 okay the next answer is 130.5 okay I've rounded it this is 184.5 this is 220.5 this is 274.5 and the last answer is 310.5 see you in the next video